Welcome to some Hockey Ultimate Team action here on EA Sports. I'm James Sabalski, and these are a couple of fun squads. I'm looking forward to this. Opening face-off just moments away. The Thunderbirds win the draw, and they'll start on the attack. Pass stolen in the open ice. Gaining speed through center, and here they come on the attack. Stones them in front. From Port Blake, denies him again. Man, James, he shows incredible quickness right there as he makes one. Oh, and it goes off the outside of the post. That's frustrating, James. The score is 0-0, and oh, what a miss as it goes off the post and out. New York's got the puck inside the defensive zone. Tried to get 2Q with it and loses possession. Well, he's showing off his skill set, trying to make a silky move around the defender, but he gets denied. Made that stop. I really like the save, James, because he challenges the shooter who's all alone in the slot area. He turns aside a real dangerous opportunity. And they cough it up in the neutral zone. Oh, a huge hit against the wall, and you know Oh, what a chance here! Ran on a runway on the play. Here's a chance, sends it in front. Misses. Taken by Morrissey. Scores! Quick blast, no chance. The Sabres finally break the ice and get the game's first goal. Yeah, and it's an important one, James, because there's not much room out there and not much separating these two teams. So that little bit of a cushion may give them the stir, the press they need to be more consistent and try and get another one on the board. New York's got it in their own zone. Into the attacking area from the left side. Beautiful feed up ahead from the right wing side. The Sabres will play the puck from behind the net. Here he is from the slot. Denies him. Goaltender spent so much time doing tracking exercises, and it's utilized right here as he knows where this puck is coming from, and he makes the save. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. Swing and a miss. New York's trying to make something happen in the offensive zone. Stones him on the one-timer. Here he is, shot right in front. Save on the play. Takes the feed. Let's move to the middle. And he denies that great opportunity there. Play blown dead. Let's get the call. A tough penalty to take as you're looking for the equalizer. You're in a one goal deficit. And you got to find a way to generate offense, James. Real tough one to take. The Sabres played along the wing. He got all of that one. Great save by the goaltender to get a pass. Keeping the puck out of the net. Deflected away. Nice defensive use of the stick there. The Sabres gain possession along the wall. Takes it up, but he's still got the puck. Oh, set that hit up perfectly. Moves it to LaFontaine. Grabs the puck and looks to make something happen. And a huge stop by the goaltender at point-blank range. It's amazing to me how he always looks like he's in the right position because he tracks and reads the play so well. And this time he gets in front of the puck that's right in the middle of the ice as the shooter's got a dangerous opportunity. New York's got a hold of it against the wall. Stopped by the goaltender. Fowler's lugging the puck. And it's a quick pass to Petrangelo. Moves the puck. Now a quick pass to Petrangelo. And that's turned aside. Drives it to the crease. Makes the save. Back to the point it goes. And he hangs on just as time runs out. And that'll put a bow on the first 20 minutes of action here tonight. We've got lots more still to come. Second period is just around the corner.
The middle stanza is about to go. The official's ready to drop the puck. Still a lot of hockey left in this one as period number two gets underway. Well, Cheryl, how do you sum this one up through the first 20 minutes? The Sabres have the majority of shots in this one. It's a reason they're in the lead, James. But after the shot, they're also retrieving. So they've got their opponent right where they want him on their heels. Oh, quick move, he's in! Oh, beautiful save on the play! And you gotta love these one-on-one -on -one battles. In particular, the goaltender, so aggressive, tracks the puck and makes the save. And the shot dies in the traffic jam. There's a solid collision. Putting the hard hat on here. What a hit. Didn't get all of it, but just got enough of it with the trapper. Great heads up play in the defensive zone. Change it up. Moves into the slot. How did he stop that one? This is a fantastic save, James. He's all over it. What I mean by that is he knows exactly where it is and where it's moving. A reason why he can get square to it and make the save. The Sabres ready to go on the attack. A chance in front! Turns it away! This is a really nice save, James. I mean, the shooter's in the middle of the ice. He's in the slot area. And he's got to get to the top of the crease, square to the puck to be able to make that save. Great job. Handles the pass. Make a change, make a change. Here's an opportunity in front of the net. Angles it over to Dunn. The Sabres scoop it up along the boards. Feeds it to Milano. And he coughs it up with the pass. Here he is, all alone. Tremendous defensive play. Well, that's all about pace and foot speed. The ability to get back through the middle of the ice and then find an opportunity to get the stick. New York's got control of it now from their own end. They've got numbers. She gets in with the goaltender and she figures the goalie out, knows where to go with the puck using great deception and buries it home. That'll be trending on social media tonight. Anytime you're net front or tight to the net, these are hard goals. You gotta be accurate and you gotta get a quick release shot off. Otherwise, the coverage and the goaltender is gonna be right in your face. Past the midway mark of the frame, we got a tie game. The Sabres win the draw here in the neutral zone. Takes it to the front! Big time stop! Whiffs on that! Duchesne's got the puck! Hard blast! And the lane's clogged up blocking that! Feeds it on over to Carpenter! Here's a pass in front! Oh, and she whiffs on the play! Nice feed from the goaltender. Oh, she just clobbered her! Uh, she got all of her body behind that one, James Steamrolled. And he makes the save on that play. Well, that shot came quick, and it was right out front. He had to be sharp. He had to be right on it and show his brilliant reflexes. New York's got the puck. And that's broken up by Athanasiu. Thunderous hit it! Look at that! The pane of glass is cracked! Well, yeah, I mean, what a hit, right? What a blow, and you can see it right there. There's a spidering crack, and listen, you gotta make sure that this is taken care of, because it gets hit again, it will shatter. So, safety is of the priority right now, James. Here in the late goings of the period, we are all tied up in this one. And less than a minute to go here in the middle frame. Morrissey's got it in the defensive end. Picked up along the boards by Foldy. Centering pass. He scores! What a goal! The Thunderbirds have persevered. They've weathered the storm. And look at this. They now lead here late in the second. Nah, this should give them a real jolt here, James. And now heading to the intermission with the lead. And this is really important that they feed off of that energy and they come out in the third flying. And there's the horn. Two down, one more to go. Both teams will get a chance to uh, catch their breath and get ready for a big third period next. Two down, one to go. Third period, they're ready to drop the puck. And they have dropped the puck here on the final frame. 
Cheryl, 40 minutes in the books now played. How do you view this one? The Sabres don't need to change their game plan, James. I mean, they're trailing by one goal, but they found a way to own the puck for the majority of the game, and this is a good sign. Anytime you're holding the puck, now it's about being opportunistic and finding a way to get some net front presence and put one by the tender. Scoops up the puck. From the blue line, they take control of it. Denies that opportunity. The Sabres have it in the offensive zone. Getting a little physical there with that collision. And he takes the pass. Solid hit on the play. Still has possession. We got a penalty coming up here on the play. There's the whistle, and here's the call. Well, this is a critical juncture of the game. You've got the one goal lead, and now you take a penalty. The PK unit has to be the task and kill this off. The Sabres send their men advantage unit out once more. Well, they earn this a power play, James, through hard work, and it's an opportunity to even the score here. They need to find a way to execute and get back to the even score. Moves the puck to Retray. Great heads-up play in the neutral zone by Malkin. Taken along the wall by Ehlers. At center ice now, he grabs the puck. Oh, and a good textbook hit there. And now it's grabbed by Ehlers. Picked up along the wall by Kuznetsov. Fowlers cross the line and gain the zone. Moves it around along the half wall. The Sabres gain possession in their own end. Here's a chance to the middle. And that's off target. Oh, denies him with the paddle save. You have to be quick in your crease if you want to be able to deny low zone shots. He does that perfectly as he's tight to the shooter right there. Feeds the puck over to Kuznetsov. Oh, and a misfire as that goes right out of the zone. Puck picked up by Dunn. He got all of that hit. Centering feed, and he shuts down a great scoring chance there. And they go back on the attack in the offensive zone. Barzell's been tripped up, and we got a penalty coming up here. And they're going to be shorthanded once again, much to the chagrin of these fans. What is that? Is that three in a row now? Yeah, that's three in a row. You got it. And the fans certainly don't like it, but it's not up to them, is it? But now they're back to the PK. So difficult to get any kind of flow in a game when you're marching to the penalty box. Takes possession of the puck off the draw. And that one's turned away. Directed over to Everly. New York's got the puck here in the open ice. Sends it over to Barcel. Steps in all of that. New York's got possession while undermanned. He says, let's get physical on that play. And that plays offside. We got a face-off coming up. Special teams so important. Can they capitalize on this power play here with a face-off? The Sabres will start off on the attack after winning the draw. Scores! And we are tied after that power play mark. Well, it's perfectly executed, and the coach has their most skilled offensive players out there for that very reason. They tied the game. When we have a look at it, James, it looks like it's redirected, and that's just beautiful timing and get the hands away from the body, be able to get it to go the opposite direction of the goaltender. The Sabres have scratched and clawed their way to making this a tie game here at a critical point in the third. That's critical timing, James. The bench just erupts with that equalizer. And listen, when you score a goal like this, often you put your opponent on their heels because they knew they had the game within reach. Now it's a much different story. Forces the turnover in the neutral zone. Here's a chance in front. Oh, and they can't connect on the pass because it was broken up in front. Poked away at center by Ehlers. Petrangelo stick handling in his own zone. Makes his press. And that deadlock is broken as they take the lead. Well, that's a huge shift. You can see everyone standing up on the bench. They know how much it means, but it's the next shift that matters most now, James. You want to kind of push and put pressure on your opponent when they're down. 
That's what you call having a knack for the net, James. When you get in tight and you're sniffing around, you better get that puck off quickly because you know there's defenders all in around you that are going to come and close. The Sabres have had more scoring chances, and yet they trail late in this third period. Center's jammed up, and the winger grabs the puck. Uses the force on that hit. Scooped up along the wall by McCarr. Moves it quickly over to Tuck. Grabs the puck. And the traffic jam in front blocks the shot. Barnes has the puck inside the defensive zone. I don't think anybody was hanging on to the puck after that hit. Levels him with the hit. And he's ridden off the puck. New York's got a hold of it along the wall. Quick pass to LaFontaine. Oh, just a textbook hit. And he slides it quickly to Duchesne. The Thunderbirds look to start the transition game. Everly's taking it from his own end. Referee's hand goes up and he's done.